A sigh of relief tonight for parents and students in Kirkwood. Two schools were put on lockdown as police search for a home invasion suspect. The tense situation unfolded just 24 hours after the school shooting in Uvalde, Texas. Our Pepper Baker is live outside the Kirkwood Police Department. And Mike, police are still searching for the suspect tonight. Now the home invasion happened near North Glendale Elementary and the Kirkwood Early Childhood Center. And during the lockout, no one was allowed in or out of those schools for a few hours. North Glendale Elementary School students didn't expect their last day of school to end quite like it did. She told us that we had to run because there was an invasion. Ninth grader Paige Warfield was visiting her former elementary school teachers when administrators went into an emergency lockout procedure. I was talking to two of my teachers, right? And so um, they were all like panicking and I was kind of confused. And so then they went into the building and they like locked down. I called my mom and I was running with my friend and we were kind of panicking. So shortly after the school's 1230 PM early dismissal, Kirkwood Schools Chief Communications Officer Steph Diedrich said they followed police orders that there was police activity in the area and they encouraged that we go on lockout status, which means that we took all uh, staff and any remaining students that were in the building, asked them to come inside and remain inside. Police were investigating a home invasion nearby on Brownell Avenue. The victim called police from a neighbor's house and said the suspect had a gun and was on the run. You do have to acknowledge that national events going on uh, did raise this to an additional level. The district notified parents over email and everyone was released by 3 p.m. Brooks Colvin picked his daughter up before the lockout and is glad everyone is safe. Anything like that obviously sparks a ton of emotion because of what's happening and it can happen anywhere. And uh, yeah, definitely nervous, called my wife and just said we're good, right? Now, police say a subject was taken in for questioning, and now they believe that this was a targeted event, not a random act. But as of now, the armed suspect is still on the loose. Live in Kirkwood, Pepper Baker, 5 on your side.